All right, in this video, we're going to take a quick uh, walk through here of the landing page generator so you can get familiar with it and uh, go ahead and start making those mock-ups and go out there and use it to start landing some clients. So in the future videos and future modules, we're going to get more into setting up the Google campaigns and writing the ads and doing all that stuff. But, uh, you know, first things first, go through all the videos in module one and then also uh, keep, keep learning uh, here about landing pages and start making these demos to go out and start landing those clients and by the time you land them, you'll have all the training and everything ready and available for you uh, about setting up the campaigns and writing ads and everything you need. So let's take it step by step. Let's take action each step of the way. Stay focused on each step, each step of the way. And that's the, the best way that I've seen people get results. So let's get into this here. Um, starting with the, I'm going to walk you through kind of each one of these fields just so you get familiar with them. And uh, you should have a couple, uh, at least a couple of different uh, pre-written landing pages and for a couple of different niches here like the mortgage niche here, which is what we're going to uh, uh, type in here and just use as the example. And in the next video, I'll show you another example, okay, as well, um, and uh, of the landing page generator using a video on the page. But for this one here, let's, let's first go through this template. And um, here, I already created the page. And as you can see, the first thing here is to choose your template. Template one is black, template two is white, okay? This is, what that means is the header. That's the header. So you see the header here is black. So for this, this company, they had a white logo on a black background. So basically, if that's the case, you're going to use the black template. Now, if you look at this one, for example, uh, this one has a white background. So if you were using that logo, you would use the white template because it was on a white background. Okay. Um, next thing here is the, and that's two different landing page templates there, which is cool because if you're, if you're doing, um, you know, just, just cool to switch it up, not always use the same exact template. And as you start building out a lot of these landing pages, when, when you land clients, um, obviously you, you're probably not going to want to use the same exact color and everything for each client that you have, especially if you start getting referrals from people that know each other. So it's cool to have a couple different options and they're both very clean looking. The white template has like a light baby blue background, still very, very professional and very good looking and a white header there instead of the black le uh, header here. So uh, that's pretty cool. That works. Now let's take a look here at the, the next thing is a title tag. A title tag is not really that important um, for what we're doing. Uh, other than it's it's the what's what people see in their browser, right? So when people, um, if someone goes to this page, when you if this page is published and someone went to that page, the title tag would be what they see in their browser at the top of their browser, just a little thing like the name of the page. Um, so again, for for a demo or a mock-up, it's not that important, um, but uh, but it's in there anyway. So uh, next thing is the logo. I've already uh, uploaded the logo for this demo here. And then the next thing is the optional media. So you can see here, you, can, you have a choice of either choosing a, a JPEG or a video. I'll show you the video in the next one, how you basically so easy to just go to YouTube and get the embed code and paste it in here and boom, you'll have, you have a video. Um, so I'll show you that in the next video, how to do that and how to grab that embed code. It's, it's super easy. I'm, I'm not technical at all and, and I can do it. So I know you can do it. Um, real simple, just cut and paste from, from under the YouTube video in a certain section. Now, where that goes is right here. So this is the optional image, and again, it's optional. You actually don't need it. I think it's nice. For example, if you have a, um, if you're going to an approach an attorney or a doctor or someone, and they have a picture of themselves on a website, maybe you that that kind of fits this area nicely. Maybe you can grab that picture and put it in here, so they see, you know, <laughs> they might like that. They see a picture of themselves there. So you have their logo, a little picture of themselves. In this case, you know, this was a mortgage lender, so you use kind of these these things here. Um, and so that's the optional image. Now again, in the next one, I'll show you the video, and, and this is where the video would go as well. So either you have a video above the headline or this optional image, or just don't enter anything into this optional image. If you, if you can't find a good image and they don't have a video, just don't worry about it. Don't even, don't enter anything here. Again, I think it looks a little nicer when you have one, but otherwise, this headline would just be moved up a little. So if you didn't have the image of the video, this headline would just be moved up a little higher. Um, if you had the video, the video would be here and the headline would be right, be right below the video. So another thing you want, you want to note here, what I did is you see how I put three different lines here, call now for your, uh, and then free quote is on the next line and then the phone number. So that makes it appear like this. I kind of like the way that this was spaced out here on the right hand side, call now for your free quote on three lines. So just a note, because I, at first, the first time I tested this builder, I had it all on one line, call now for your free quote, and it, it came out looking not the way I wanted it to over here. So uh, just know that you can actually 
put as many words on the line the same way you'd like it to appear over here. And the cool thing is, is that when you, when you put this here in the top right call to action, it also automatically puts it at the bottom here. So whatever your top right call to action is here, it's going to automatically go in the bottom right down there. So again, the next, moving right along down, the, down there, down the line here, headline. Um, obviously, that's the headline right here. This is the subheadline part one. This is the subheadline part two. And there's the four bullet points. And this is the bottom call to action. Right? I mean, pretty straightforward. Subheadline one, subheadline two, four bullets, and the bottom call to action. Then this here is the opt in text one. And what the opt in text, that goes right up here. This is opt in text number one. At the top of the opt in box, the little headline, that's opt in text one. So you put free harp quote from a harp approved local lender right here in California. And uh, that, that basically uh, has it appear. Um, has it appear right there. So the next one is opt in text number two. I typically like to restate call this number or fill in the form below to get your free consultation. And uh, that basically goes right here. That, that'll be the, that's opt in text number two right there. And then below that, you have uh, your bottom right headline and your bottom right subheadline. And that's just below the opt in box here bottom right headline, bottom right subheadline. And that is it. I mean, really, really simple to create these uh, landing page mockups here. Really, really simple. So uh, I think you got what you need. You have some pre-written uh, uh, copy for a couple different niches to use and plug in right away. And uh, start taking action and, and making these mockups and going and showing it to the businesses. And uh, start landing these first few clients. And then we'll get to uh, how to get them uh, tons of leads in the future videos.